Muscle Trouble plays Cuphead. Episode 2, Riverboat Rumble. Hello everyone, and welcome back to Muscle Gerbil Plays Cuphead. Last time we did some running and gunning. We took down one boss, it was a potato, then an onion, then a carrot. But we got his soul, we got the contract for the devil. We talked with the kind of shady coin. I'm more interested about this riverboat. Let's see what this has in store for us. Ribby and Croaks in Clip Joint Calamity. Another boss battle. Oh! A couple of toads with boxing gloves. This probably isn't gonna be good. Oh! Oh, wow! He's windmilling me. Alright. Um, I'm gonna try and focus on the little guy first. Seems like he's the easier target to hit. Oh, no! Oh, no, 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 no! Woo, that was close. We're gonna switch to spread shot. See if we can take him down quick. Oh, no, no, tornado! It's a tornado. I'm gonna try and take this... This guy down then. Ow. Oh, all right. One more hit and I'm done. I'm just gonna try and use our EX move. Hopefully we can do some damage. Oh, these guys are tough. Oh no, what's he doing? What are they doing? Dead. Only got about two-thirds of the way there. Okay. Let's try that again. These boxing toads are not messing around. Alright, I got a couple of quick parries off. That's good. I just wasted that EX move. Take down the little creatures with the spread shot. Oh, I should not have jumped. I was expecting something to parry. I'm just gonna keep on shooting. Oh, he's rolling at me again. Aha! Escaped. Alright, I'm gonna try and take out the big one now. With his... Tornado move. That seems very, very dangerous. Because the other one's projectiles are much easier to avoid. Oh, except when you get into a bad position like this. No, 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 you're not taking me down. Just gonna EX the crap out of it. Oh, they're a slot machine. Now they're a slot machine. Okay, I'm gonna have to parry when it turns red. What does that mean? And I'm dead. Okay. They start shooting out projectiles. This game is just going to be all about pattern recognition and memorization. I'm feeling much more confident now on this run. As soon as I say that I mess up two parries in a row. Of course. I, I, I like the pressure. I just, I just want the pressure of not being able to get hit. Yeah, I just, I just, you know, one hit point flashing red on the screen. Just, that's what's going to give me the fuel to get through this. I'm just going to let the wind do the work for me when it pushes me back. Oh, wow, that dodge move where I don't take damage during it is key for this fight, it seems. All right. Just gonna keep on doing damage, hopefully. Let me see if I can take the little one down. 
Whoa, that's close. All right. Just avoid the coins. Parry it. All right, now it's three tigers. It was three bulls last time. I have no idea what that is. All right, so the bosses have different forms and then different moves in their different forms. That's, uh, that's not fun. That's, that's kind of nerve-wracking. Let's see if I can do dispersed damage. Oh, he's gonna do it again. Oh! I thought I was dead. I, I thought I was dead right there. Just gonna keep... Just gonna keep spread shot... Spread shooting the crap out of this one. Dodge and shoot. Dodge and shoot. It's the name of the game. Dodging and shooting. How much damage can I do before he comes for me? Woo. Okay. I need to somehow get to this phase with more than one more than one hit point. Give me something good. Uh three frogs. I don't know what that is. Okay, I can jump on these. Okay, I like I like that. I like that. Just keep giving me three frogs then, please. I think I just wasted my, uh... Oh, how... The spikes on the side. The spikes on the side got me. Ooh. And no checkpoints, so... <laughs> just gotta get good. What do you got for me this time, buddy? Some of these parries are traps. Because as soon as you parry, you land on another projectile. So, parrying is kind of a risk-reward mechanic in this game. You know, you can take the risk and get another soup or another EX move. But you're putting yourself at risk for taking damage. And I have to keep remembering that you do earn EX moves the more you do damage to enemies. Alright. We can get through the first two phases easily now. Well, not easy because we always have one hit point when we get to the last one, but... Please be frogs. No! Whoa, they went, they were going fast and furious right there. Someone call Vin Diesel. All right, the frogs, good, good. The frog is a good one. Cause you can just kinda jump and move. As long as you got him, yes. Take that frog slot machine. Oh, our ranking's gonna be terrible. When he gets C, hey, B minus. All right. Well, that was not a fun riverboat trip. Ended up dying four times. But Ribby and Croaks' sole contract is ours now.
All right, there's this strange tree up here I want to investigate. Goopy Legrand in Ruse of a News. Another boss battle. I'm guessing we're fighting a big tree. Uh, no, we're fighting a Dragon Quest Blob. Okay, can you... Can you stop jumping? Oh! Alright, I, got, I gotta stay kinda close to it, but not that close. What do you got for me? What are you doing? Oh, I probably could have jumped. Not jumped, uh, parried all of those. Oh! Big boxing glove. Let's try that again. Oh, wow. Immediately jumped right on me. Alright. Whoop. Oh, his... His bouncing pattern can change depending on where you're at. That's pretty cool. They're not messing around when it comes to boss battles. Oh, I'm dead. He got super big and... One more time. I think I got it this time. Even though I haven't seen his third form yet. I'm having a lot of confidence in myself. This boss dodging is key. I just gotta keep using my, my dodge move. And not miss my EX moves. Or dodge right into him. Okay. Okay, I don't quite understand my dodge range. Let's try that again. It's nice he tips his cap to me, though. It's, you know, sportsmanly. Wow, I'm surprised I was actually able to get over him. I'm just gonna, we're gonna utilize the spread shot this round. No, no, no! Oh! He's got quite the reach. Come on, give me the pink question marks. That was not a good attempt at parrying those question marks. Hi. Okay, when it says you don't take damage during dashes, that's a lie. Probably should not be relying on that for anything. At least I hit him with an EX move. There we go. No, oh, don't punch me. Oh, that was close. Oh no! I panicked. I can dodge under the punch. That's duh. Oh! All right, we've almost made it to the third form. After I don't know four or five tries. Just gotta stay close to him and when he's little. Don't get too close to the edge of the screen. Or else he's gonna punch you. Or land on you. Get 
Hit him with some EX moves real quick. Dodge. Or not dodge, but duck. I'm actually kind of hoping for the punch now. Come on, you sure you don't want to try and punch me again? Because now I know you can just duck under it. Oh, I've wasted all my EX moves. Oh, he's a tombstone. Oh. Okay, he can't hit me on this plane. Oh, this form is one of the easier forms. Just dodge out of the way when he... Woo! It's like that super meathead uh, boss where he slams his face on the ground. And I'm dead. Oh, he was like two hits away. Okay. Now we've seen the third form. He's going down this time. Whatever its name is. As I just... Yeah, we're just going to take one for the team on that one. This is the run. This is the run now. Just need to not get cocky, kid. Yep, he's gonna keep bouncing around. He's gonna do his he's gonna do his thing. Oh I thought he was gonna land just short of me. Alright, he's gonna take his antacid. Alright, got big. Gonna punch. Got it. Should have space to get under him there. And then duck. Jump over me. Oh, come on. Don't you want to punch? You want to pull out that boxing glove. Yeah, that's right. Alright, time to shift over to spread you just gotta keep on the move for this form because technically he's in the background despite this being a 2d plane of existence got him How'd we do? I'm, I'm never going to get that HP bonus. Hey, an A minus. That was better than the other bosses so far. Gloopy Legrand. His soul is now ours. Let's head north. Some kind of water bottle? Let's talk to the water bottle. What's that? You two want to fly in a plane like I do? Ha! You're not sitting in any cockpit, so you study those blueprints. I didn't think studying was going to be involved in this game. Aeroplane blueprint. All right, so we're we're flying now. Oh, we can fly on the screen. That's cool. So one meter is an EX attack, but a full meter is a super bomb. And then you parry at any time. And then you can shrink.
Okay, so while I'm shooting, if I hold triangle, it decreases the range, but you're smaller. Okay. Alright, well, now we've learned how to fly a plane. I feel like we should probably log some more hours in our flight log, but... Uh, who am I to say? Hildeberg in Threatening Zeppelin. They're not even going to give us a run and gun stage. They're just going to throw us right into the boss battle. Okay. Oh, shooting words at me. Oh. Oh, wow. Just came right for us. And now she's a bull. Oh. Not today, Hilda. Oh, you move faster in mini mode, too. Okay. Oh, I... You know, I saw it coming. Just didn't even try to avoid it. Let's try that again. Some very unique enemy designs in this game. I love it. I've played UN Squadron. I should be able to do this. I attempted to play Ikaruga once. And died about... A thousand times in, you know, first couple stages. But I'm no... No stranger to shmups. That was a green one. I haven't seen the green one yet. Mega bomb! What do I do? Okay, you just kamikaze him. Oh, I was hoping to get that parry off. Oh, what is that? Oh, now we're bullet hell. Now we're bullet hell. Fantastic. Oh, which way does it start shooting? There's no indication of where it starts shooting. That's... That's insane. Oh, little frame rate dip. That was not fun. Alright, she's gotta be close to death? We're going, we're going bomb mode again. Boom! Uh, it's got an AoE effect, too. That's nice. Keep doing damage. Keep doing damage. She's going all noodly arm. And now we're fighting the moon. Oh. Oh, no. Oh, no, no, no. No, no, no. No, thank you. No, thank you. Oh, almost dead. Okay, we know the forms now. It might be... It might be just... Racking up... Racking up cards to get... To get to bomb form. And not stand right in the middle... Because that bomb seems to do a lot of damage. So we're going to use it. It might be worth it to go to the shop and grab an extra hit point for slightly decreased damage just so I can stay alive longer. Because you're dead almost instantaneously sometimes. Oh, okay. This is a new form. We haven't seen the cherub firing an arrow. I guess Cupid. Oh, I took a hit. No. Don't, don't, don't you do it. Don't do it. We gotta go bomb style. Boom. Oh. This match will get red hot. 
All right, Cuphead does not mess around. Like, this is get good or die. Okay, we got the bull form. The bull form's not too bad. Just kind of stay out of its horns. Ah! I keep missing the parries. Oh, the green one shoot triples. Alright, we're not gonna use the bomb until she changes into something. Alright, she should be she'll be coming back as something. Alright, that should have done good damage. Alright, we're going counterclockwise. Yeah, we took her out of that form really quick. Oh, I should have gone mini to avoid that. That's where the mini part comes in. I have not been utilizing that to its full extent. As soon as she turns, we're going bomb. Then we're going to go mini to get out of there. Oh, no, I missed the parry. Okay, now we need to utilize the mini form. Mini form is going to be crucial for avoiding stuff like that. Mini form is defensive, not offensive. Except when you use it like that and you run right into their attack. one of that parry. Come on, change back. Darn it. Alright, we got it this time. We know all your tricks now. Can't fool us. Or she can fool us because we're just getting hit constantly. I was fo I'm focusing too much on the smaller enemies. Just got to keep those on my periphery. Okay, I can't change weapons in this form. Like, I, there's no spread shot in the plane. I hadn't even thought of that until just now. Come on, cards. I need to get, need to get cards. All right, we're ready to go bomb mode. It's just soon as she decides to change. Alright, she'll be coming back as something else. What you got for me? Oh, of course it starts firing exactly where I am. That's alright. All right, we can get around the tornado one more mini. We got the parry. We got another parry. We're ready for bomb form. We got two hit points. We're, we are looking good. I don't know if that did any damage at all. Oh, cannot shoot through the UFO laser beams. That's interesting. Darn it. 
Don't know how I took a hit right there. Uh, I just wish I had bomb form. No! Oh, so close. So close. We got it this time. If I have three hit points going into the last phase, I can beat this. As soon as I say something, I just just need to stop having these self self fulfilling prophecies. That's just taking one for the team right there. I like how the first form is bull because uh, this is some bull at the moment. That's only because I'm just I'm just playing so bad. Oh wow, that was a quick quick attack. That was off timing. But like I said, I like I like the pressure. I just want to have one hit point the entire time. I really thought I was about to die right there. When she was coming back from off screen, I really thought that was the end. And there's there is no way to get health back in any of these levels. All right, we're at moon phase. We're gonna do some try and do some damage during moon phase. No! Alright, that's death number 20 for this episode. Not just even the playthrough. For this episode. Yeah, the timing on the bull can be a little weird. It'll go fast and then slow. So we just just keep it moving. Hopefully this is where, hopefully we've, we've, you know, reached cruising altitude and we're going to be starting our final descent into the lovely Cuphead land and take this boss down. Okay, that one agreed with me this time. It didn't start, start off right next to me. All right, you go mini for the tornado. Miss the parry. It would be nice if there was, like, when two of them arrived, there was always a parry. Alright, we have made it with three hit points to the final phase. This is nice. We're gonna go bomb. That was kind of an oh crap moment. Got her! Got her without taking a hit. Oh yeah. That only took double digit deaths. No parries. Not a single one. 
Gotta be. Soul Contract, Hildeberg. Well, all right then. So, we took down two bosses this episode. A couple of boxing toads. And uh, a flying monstrosity. We got two more souls for the devil. Oh, wait a minute. We also took down the tree. So we took out three bosses. After after that many deaths, your memory starts to get a little fuzzy. So we took down took down the tree. We took down the flying monstrosity, and we took down the toads. Hopefully, there are some more running gun levels. But we're gonna keep exploring the crazy world of Cuphead next time.